Hi everyone, welcome back. My name is Ingrid Meller and I'm one of our art therapists here at Closure for One and this is my second video for week eight in which I'll be showing you another kind of poster that you can make. So if you're just joining us for this one and you didn't do the other one, a poster is something where you can express yourself and have your voice put out there. And in this one in particular, we're going to be making a poster about something that you're proud of about yourself or your community or your family and I think for all of you it'd be great if you could make something about what you're proud of so it could be something that you've learned or something that you do that's helpful for others or anything about yourself that you want for the world to know and to see about you in particular and so for my video I actually made mine about who I'm most proud of, which would be all of you, all of our children and the families at Culture for One who are coming back every week and working so hard on your art and your dancing and keeping your dreams going when I know it's a really hard time to be doing that. So I'm going to show you my poster. So what I did, like I talked about in the other video, is I started with the words of what I want to say, and I'm sorry this is backwards, but you'll be able to see it in the picture in the end. Um, so I put culture for one, children and families, because I'm so proud of all of you and everything that you're always doing to keep learning and keep reaching for your dreams. And then around that I'm putting different things that are representative of that, so different pictures. So I put artists, because a lot of you are artists coming back every week with me and trying different things. And I'm so proud of you for that, because I know it's not always easy, especially when we don't always have all the materials that we usually have. But sometimes what makes a great artist is figuring out how to do what you what you need to do and say what you need to say no matter what. So I'm making, this is a palette and I'm putting different colors in. Sometimes people think of paint when you represent or when you are thinking of artists. Although I know all of you have been following along with the videos and trying different ways of expressing yourself through art like using recycled materials or whatever you have to draw with. And that is really, really great for you as an artist. Put a paintbrush there. So artists. And then writers. So I know a lot of you do our different writing workshops. And that is really exciting. Writing is something that is not always easy to do. So I'm proud of all of you for for trying that and learning it. Dancers. So I know a lot of you do our dance classes with Culture for One. And I know a lot of you are tuning in still to learn how to dance on our videos. And that's really great that you're dancing wherever you can. So these are ballet slippers, but all kinds of dance that you're trying, you know, hip hop and jazz and everything that you're doing is represented here. And then New Yorkers, because we all live in New York at Culture for One. So you're out there and you're trying different things in your city whenever you can. Fashion designers, I know a lot of you have been doing that. Or learning how to draw in that way. So I did an image to represent a fashion drawing. So for your poster, whatever you're making that you're proud of, it could just be one thing. So maybe you're proud that you've been trying to be a fashion designer, or you're proud that you've been dancing, so you could choose one of those and draw yourself doing one of those things or draw whatever that looks like to you. And then I know we have a lot of amazing singers that are taking lessons with Culture for One. So 
So I have that on here. If that were something you were proud of, you could draw yourself singing or draw whatever that looks like to you. And then the last one that I put is future entrepreneurs. So that means an entrepreneur is somebody who's always thinking of new ideas and creating new things. And I think all of you, by, by learning, you're already doing that. So this is my poster of what I am most proud of, and that's all of you today. And I hope that you can enjoy making a poster. Maybe it's about one of these things that you're learning how to do. Maybe it's about your culture. Maybe it's about where you're from, your family, where you live. It can be about anything that is a part of you. And I wrote some of those examples in the captions for this video so that you can sort of get your ideas going. And I hope that this is something that is fun and makes you feel really good. And of course, as always, please share with us at Culture for One if you like. See you next week.